I would like to show you how to create a tag and how to uh, define widgets uh, on the dashboard uh, with uh, tags. So what is a tag at the things I owe? So the things I owe um, to enable uh, access to a subset of devices, we created the concept of hashtag. So um, having these hashtags uh, in the apps that I'm going to show you in future videos and, or on widgets, you can specify just to see subset of devices. That, let me give you an example. So you only want to see the devices that have an incident. <clears throat> so here's the solution. It's uh, to create the tag incident and then specify on the map that you only want to see the devices uh, with the attack uh, incident. Okay, so let me show you how this works, right? So actually manually to change the tags, um, you, you have to go to the things manager. Let's say the things manager, you go to, to, the, to the product. And then when you get into one specific device, um, you can see here on the details, box, things, tags, um, space, okay? In this case, actually on this demo, we have 50 devices, 25 are company A, 25 are company B. Actually, from 1 to 25, it's company A. To, from 26 to 50, it's company B. But we can act a, a new tag. Let's say incident or alarm, alarm tag. Let's say like this, okay? So now this device, actually, if you, I want, we want to see the subset of devices with the tag, alarm tag, uh, it's pretty straightforward. We need to use this tag. So let's go back to the dashboard and let's edit the map. Okay. And we can actually specify here from, from this part that I want to enable filter by tag. You click here and we say alarm tag. We click done, okay, and automatically we save. We only see the device 36, okay, with this, uh, that it's the only one with this tag, okay? And actually with the, with the widget uh, of the tables, it's, it's exactly the same. So we call it filter by tag, okay? We call filter by tag and we say alarm tag, okay, and we click done. Okay, and we only see the 36. Okay, um, what if we have a lot of tags and we want to uh, yeah, enable people to access to the different subsets that we have? So it's pretty simple. We just in, uh, click show filter by tag. We don't define any set tags. And then we click done. What we get here, it's, the, it's just a list of uh, all the tags that we have, we have company B, company A, and, and other tags that we have been playing with. So we have here the alarm tag with the number 36. So this is another possibility. Actually, the map works exactly the same, okay, and in the applications as well. So in future videos, I'm going to show you how to create map uh, tags automatically from Cloud Code, and of course, how to create, uh, so how to use tags on applications or distributors. Okay, have a good day. Bye-bye.